in this video I'm going to show you that how you can basically package your game for production level and how you can upload your game on Google Play Store by using Unreal Engine 5.1.1 that is the lastest version of Unreal Engine in currently okay so you have question that bro are you have experience that you are uh, you're showing that yeah how you need to do that or blah 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 stuff yep i have experience even you can want if you want you can test my game in google play store which is available on google play store called astra developer and you'll find all of my game okay so now let's get started the first you need to create a project okay without project you're never able to do anything okay then you need to go basically to your file then project settings okay so you can go to edit and project settings once you go there there you find the basically the description area so you can fill out your basically information like your website name your project description you can write everything at here okay this is uh, some you know important part so you can do that then second step is basically you need to go to uh, google pad and at here you need to enable it the en plugin so what does this thing do that it's basically enable the google asset delivery system for your game which is basically allowed you to upload more than 4 gigabyte game in Google Play Store because by default uh, the Google rule is with APK plus OBB without using Google Asset Delivery System you can upload highest 115 MB with APK plus OBB okay but if you have more than that so you need to use the Google Asset Delivery System by enabling this plugin you will be able to do everything then go to package settings then include here the maps that which one you have basically like if you have for example the your all maps like tdm map lobby map you need to add them all so it will basically help you to redact your game size and uh, fast to it's also help you to package your game very quickly okay and make sure that you press on this button very quickly on uh, export on or google only that affected on the google then at the pre-install uh, installer you need to tick that because it's give you an installer file okay and make sure the distribution file and rebuild file is enabled otherwise google uh, the unreal even never generate the app abb file or android app bundle okay make sure that is in the shipping mode and once you do that you need to go basically to your <coughs> on your android at here you need to fill up your unreal engine package name or your basically game package name then you need to set your the store uh, version number so what does this thing do that it's basically a specific number if in the future uh, if you want to update your game so that case you need to increase this value otherwise if you're doing first time so you can leave it like that how it was right now okay and make sure you can set the api level and you can also give your game name format here and make sure you say, uh, set up the api level 32 that is the uh, you know the android version the last is and then once you do that everything you need to here from here you need to just select your icons name and make sure that you last you need to must set the sdk at last 30 okay targeted sdk otherwise google will not allow you to upload your game on google play store so make sure you do that okay and just create some uh, you know icons for your game and just select them at here so it will look very good and make sure that the show uh, slab skin or launcher skin is disabled okay otherwise it will be show error so once you give just give a package and once you build the package uh, you can set it to as you can see the build success it takes lots of time for me but yeah once it's package you'll be find something like this called you find in your folder you find a abb file a obb file then a generated file then you find the uh, the libs so file and at the last you find also the installer file okay but we only need to upload the abb file so it's simply uh, just create a video for your game like what is the gameplay if you want this is optional if you don't want so you can basically skip this part okay so now let's start uh, uploading game on google play store okay so once you create this uh, video or anything else like a kind of like video this as i said that this is optional but make sure the website privacy policy is must needed so you can include your basically game policies like whatever game your game using like any uh, third party software or third party access or anything else legal information and at the last make sure people can uh, if the user want to reach your with you so make sure you add your telegram discord and the others if you have any social account so you need to add them and make sure that everything is properly set up otherwise it will be reject by google play store okay so make sure you have these two things now let's start create a app then select your game name 
make sure your game can contain highest 30 characters otherwise uh, you know you can't upload more or write more than 30 words in your uh, title or name and then you need to in the limitation package or the verse uh, the language you can set it to english but by default if you want you can change that then in the game category what is it you can set it to game and then there's two options called free for get my paid course you can visit my udemy account there's a lots of tutorial available also if you want to play my game you can check that on steam app store and google play store also we have now the discord channel so you can join there and do lots of fun and it is more also for get more information for our about video you can check our website also you can get my paid asset and plugins in epic marketplaces link in the description link below free and paid the free is basically that you are publishing your game in free but in a paid you are basically setting your game price make sure which one you select you never able to change that in future so make sure do it properly and carefully okay otherwise you need to delete your game or re-upload it again okay so simply create a app <clears throat> once you do that you need to now set up this stuff like set up your app page so at here you need to fill up this form the first form is basically uh, as you can see you need to first fill up your their privacy policy so copy your website url which are where you write basically your privacy policy and other stuff so once you do that simply paste that here and you know just paste that here okay once you do that uh, make sure that just click on first uh, say okay and once you save then you second you need to set the app access functionality that is basically if you, if in your game if there's a anything like you know uh, like some special access or any other stuff so you can basically set that here okay or you can basically write at here if there's anything more or otherwise if your game is uh, totally free or there's a no issue or kind of like there's a no login system so you can basically skip this part okay and yeah that is basically the function access or app access stuff so save and then back then the second op third option is ads so basically if you're con your, if your game contains ads so you can set up here that uh, my game show ads or if you want you can set it to no also but make sure if you set no so in future if you update your uh, game if you google find the sdk for in your game so google will basically tell you to basically update your game again or add system so make sure by default if you have feature plan that okay updating game so you can do that okay now so <clears throat> you can just click on save by placing save it's basically now allowing ads okay then you find basically the content rating the content rating is basically it will be asked about your game like are you game content evaluation and other stuff so make sure <coughs> you need to first add your email so with that basically it's allow you to uh do uh, you know contact so at the valuation settings so you can basically add it to no then fair you need to put value to no okay that is basically very important and then just so simply click on no that any gambling app language so you will need to basically read this properly otherwise you'll be faced very problem so make sure you check carefully and then you do it okay otherwise you'll face very big problem okay and then once you set up like this so at the last it will be ask you about the virus are your game content name virus or other stuff so yeah that is basically the stuff so if your game contain any virus or other stuff so it will you need to set up yes otherwise press no 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 and you know everything to no because you don't do anything just simply click and save and it will be show you like this okay and once you do like this you find a content rating from google that which is basically it's showing okay and at the last you need to set the target audience that is basically the age of user like which you, which age of user will play your game basically so i'm setting 16 to 17 and 18 over so it's basically allow me to uh, play this range user my game okay so we can basically set it to uh, save but if you want you can set a more low age it depends on you but make sure more low age contain more stuff 
so yeah, it will ask you to any children access or policy so you need to press it to no because we don't want or the children don't want to do that so simply save 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 and back once you do that you find basically uh, the option in the new app or not so no your game is not a new app and then it will be ask you that this is a covid 19 status app or not so you need to again paste it that no your game is not a covid 19 status app so then it will be ask you to data safety basically with this feature if your game collecting any third party or user data kind of like email a pass and anything else so else uh, at that time you need to paste that last you find the government apps are your game is a government apps or not so at here you need to put <laughs> so at here you need to add the app category you can set your game category or whatever game it is so you need to the tag is basically very important so also it's help you to rank your game so make sure you write and add proper uh, a tag with your game make sure you don't use any useless tags otherwise your game can be unranked so make sure your add the tags goodly otherwise it will be never work so make sure you add proper tags relative which is your app otherwise google whenever it will review they will basically you know do a stuff so now here you find the store uh, contact and other stuff so you can you need to be spaced at here and website <coughs> so you need to just again you know upload your website again and then you can basically yep uh, external marketing yep you will basically doing that so simply click on save so yeah that is the basically all this stuff so now you can come to back to dashboard okay and now the last step is uploading the game okay or uploading that file so now before do that just import or write the short description the short description and long description basically the are like this like option like there's the image and that's about our game that is the long description and there's some information it's short description about that so i prefer you to create a word like that a word sheet so where you write everything like short and link and other stuff so with that basically it's basically help you to do all the work you know easily and other stuff so just fill up this one by one make sure it should be relative with your game you don't write anything you know blah blah stuff otherwise google will reject that so make sure you write everything everything properly and so as you can see it's saying that uh, i write uh, more than 40 words so at here you can need to write at least under 40 so make sure you do that and then the long description just you know paste the long description whatever you write about your game how your game can be play uh, what is basically your game motive and other stuff so um, also you can write some information about set uping like the setup in range like the android version android uh, bit rate and ram storage and other stuff you can all include that at here okay and once you do that at the last you need to upload the icons for your game okay uh, because uh, the icon is basically help you to display your game so you also must need to upload the icon for your game otherwise it will be never work okay so i'm just uh, doing some uh, last edit so i'm also checking that is everything is uh, working or not and then you need to create a new release and just upload your abb file okay so and then like that upload and you can upload icons and basically you your and then upload the icons for your game okay like basically whichever icon picked so you need to just select them all and then save all and again give again and then again just you know upload or select your basic icons and other stuff and again if you have any icons then 
okay just do like this okay just you need to take some screenshot of your game and you know uh, it will be work so make sure uh, you contain everything possible like for the mobile for the web okay but yeah if you want to for chrome you need to do customizely so for now um, that is speaking uh, you know skipping this part and everything is done so you need to click on save and then we are moving to our next step okay so yeah let's move into our next step so the next step you need to set up for the release one okay so make sure you can you can select the countries and other stuff so let's do that then you need to go to production and just create a new release okay make sure so just simply click on new release and then you need to upload here your abb file make sure you don't press on this button otherwise they will be generate a new sync file so simply click on upload and from here you need to only select your abb file not the obb file okay you know just need to upload the android app bundle okay at the release your uh, name and other stuff if you want you can write something but this is not necessary okay and that's all for uploading game on google play store i hope you understand so thank you so much for watching and guys if you are this game was already now published on play store so you can check that by searching astro developer or bar shooter unreal okay so thank you so much for watching guys love you all see you in next tutorial video For get my paid course, you can visit my Udemy account. There's a lots of tutorial available. Also, if you want to play my game, you can check that on Steam, App Store, and Google Play Store. Also, we have now the Discord channel, so you can join there and do lots of fun and need to see more. Also, for get more information for our about video, you can check our website. Also, you can get my paid asset and plugins in Epic Marketplaces. Link in the description link below.